Hello guys, we're gonna do a Trinity Knot once again today. This time I'm gonna slow it down, keep it slow, reverse the video for ease of use, make this the best tutorial for a Trinity there is. Okay, we're really gonna take it seriously here. I have a very skinny tie from ultimatesilktie.com. Look how skinny that is, it's almost the same length. It's awesome, I love the skinny ties. I'm gonna come clean, I love them. So, big end is on my left side, little end is on my right side. Little end goes over, and through the top. Now you're gonna go, you're gonna make a spiral motion by going around the same side. You just, you're gonna follow the loop around the same side. Now you're gonna go around the back and then up through the middle and to the bottom. Don't panic. It's, instructions are hard, but this is a just classic Windsor beginning, okay? Now keep this loose. Go around horizontally and then come around through the top. Keep it loose. Now look, if we go right through the bottom right now, we make a half Windsor knot and uh, it's ready to go. I mean, don't wear that because the little end's in the front. That's reverse, but I mean, the position. Anyway, take this and go around the back and then come back around and go through here. There we go. Now, I like to keep this knot very loose the whole way through. I think it looks better the looser it is. Uh, it looks more round and more like a hexagon and less like a triangle if you keep it loose. So that's what I usually do. You can tighten it if you like that look better, you know, that's fine. So here we go. That is the Trinity Knot dressed for success. Thanks for watching.